1967, several researchers in Europe began experiencing symptoms of a mysterious new disease. It was later identified as Marburg virus, which researchers contracted after handling a consignment of African green monkeys from Uganda. This new disease was so contagious and deadly that CDC researchers invented a new laboratory with a higher level of biological containment to safely study it. This new maximum containment facility was mobile and built in the back of an 18-wheeler using air-sealed cabinets with glove inserts to conduct experiments in the CDC's parking lot. Only a few years later, the United States Army Medical Research Institute of Infectious Diseases opened the first permanent maximum containment laboratory in Maryland. For a long time, there were only a few of these labs in the US and Europe. But more recently, they've been appearing all over the world, with even more planned since the COVID-19 pandemic. What's behind the rise of these maximum containment laboratories? 